Now the latest on the rust set shooting embattled armorer Hannah Gutierrez Reed is now fighting back today against comments that were made by the sheriff in charge of the investigation, linking her with issues on another movie set. ABC's Kaylee Hartung brings us this. Okay. You're not arrested. This morning, the armor from the set of Rust hitting back at the Santa Fe Sheriff's Office for comments he made leading to what she calls an erroneous implication. In an email to the district attorney, Hannah Gutierrez Reed's attorney demanding Sheriff Mendoza amend or retract recent statements following his massive release of evidence in the Rust investigation, which they believe have led some to conclude that Hannah may have brought live rounds or fired live rounds on a previous movie set and also on the set of Rust. I think there was uh, several text messages and emails in reference to the use of possible um, live rounds on a different movie set. Uh, that's concerning because that was just a few months before the, uh, the production of Rust went into effect and uh, these are some of the same people, some of the same uh, employees and people that played a role in the Rust uh, production. So that's concerning. Her attorney writing this was recklessly false and there is no evidence to support this misstatement, adding that these comments revealed a lack of attention to the evidence within his possession. Overnight, the attorney to the film's prop master, Sarah Zachary, supporting Gutierrez Reed. I think he did what he felt he was supposed to do as her attorney and I saw nothing uh, inappropriate with it and uh, I think he probably did the right thing. The sheriff facing heat from multiple sides. Helena Hutchins family also slamming the department for releasing the trove of evidence, including officers body cam video showing the final moments of the cinematographer fighting for her life, saying in a letter they had less than a business day to review crucial video evidence before it was recently released to the public, writing that the office trampled on the constitutional rights of Hutchins and failed to give the family dignity and privacy citing the New Mexico Constitution's right to request that discretion be exercised and sensitive material be redacted. And legal experts say the amount of information released was unprecedented. And it also included personal details for some cast and crew members, like their social security numbers, cell numbers, and email addresses. Now, the sheriff says he was obligated to make this release in response to a public records request. Kaylee Hartung, ABC News, Las Vegas.